Hey guys, my name is Angelia and welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge. I know it's been a hot minute since we've gotten to play this one, um, and especially also for the Legacy Challenge and the Asylum Challenge, which I swear I'm getting back to. Um, it's just been kind of crazy trying to deal with the 10 Little Sims because that takes a lot of work and planning and putting that episode all together. So in a way, I'm very glad that it's over because it took me so long to get those episodes ready, like at least two to three hours every night before and stuff that I would be posting and all that fun stuff, but um, I did want to go ahead and get back to the 100 baby challenge. Oh, and also, sorry about all the uh, city living parts recently. I'm just kind of obsessed. But um, while we are here, I do want to change the lot traits now that we finally can. Um, I mean, I guess we don't technically need that, right? I'm gonna leave the homey one, so let's go and pick out some other ones. I do. I want to do the on ley line one, um, because that's kind of perfect for this sort of challenge. Um, is it child's play? Yeah, I think I want to do child's play. Oh, I kind of want to do gnomes though too. Oh my gosh, there's so many I want to do. Okay, on ley line is definite. I feel like Child's Play definitely has to be one. Maybe we could do without Homie. I don't know, because things seem to break all the time. That's kind of why I want to do the nose. But then Penny Pixies could be really good, because we don't have a ton of money. Oh, I think she's already a level 10 cook, so I don't think I'm going to worry about that one too much. We are going to try out um, gnomes, because why not? Wait, what's Great Soil do? Ah, we do have a garden, but okay, no, no, no. We're gonna stick with this one. If you guys want me to change out gnomes or maybe child's play, let me know, but I'm definitely keeping the on ley line one. That one, like, that's mandatory. <laughs> that has to stay. Absolutely has to stay. Um, so here we go. Um, I believe she's still in her second trimester. Uh, it froze. That's cool. That's what I like to hear. Come on. Game, please. There we go. Um, yeah, she's in her second trimester, so in about eight hours she'll be in her third. Um, how are you doing? You are quite hungry, but it looks like you're eating that cake. Um, is this fruit cake? We're just, uh, gonna slide that right on in there. <laughs> no one wants the fruit cake. How are you doing, Mom? Not great. You need to pee. Everything's disgusting. Um, I'm gonna have her grab something. She really needs- to, there's nothing in there. Okay, never mind. Um, so she's gonna have to serve dinner. Um, oh, she's so uncomfortable from that freaking fruitcake. Um... Tofu chicken. Ooh, let's do a roast chicken. Oh no, let's do gumbo, because it reminds me of, a. Uh, is she reading on the toilet? Is that what she's doing right now? <laughs> Cordelia. Cordelia, please. Please, Cordelia. Oh my gosh, there's a gnat in my room. And it just flew in front of my face and I'm kind of freaking out. Where did you go? Okay, it's like... Can, can it get cold in Vegas already? I'm kind of over this whole bug situation. Not quite a fan. Are you going to bed? Oh, I guess you are tired. <gasps> Yawn! Back in my nowhere. Why are you not cooking? So there's cake right there. Can you eat this, actually? Yes, you totally can. Uh, why don't you... No, you're the wrong one. I need you to take a piece. And I'll just pop that right there. There we go. Um, how are you doing? You are super tired. Yeah, go to bed, honey. How are you, my friend? You good? Okay. Um, have you done your homework is the real question. Nope. But he is really tired and I don't want to put the homework thing above his actual needs. So like, I mean, we're, we'll get to it, obviously. We will get to it. I'm not too worried about it. If it takes a little bit longer, then it takes a little bit longer. I'm not too pressed about it. All right. Well, let's open that and pop this cake on in here. 
Um, so you're the only one up, honey. And you're already tired. Well, great. Um, can I put this in the fridge or anything? Nope. Uh, I'm gonna have to have her go to bed. She's really tired. Go to sleep, honey. Alright, here we go. Now we can actually fast forward at super speed. I'm really hoping a, like, festival will come to town. Like, I think that would be a lot of fun, but knowing my luck, it probably won't. It looks like all these are gonna be able to be harvested. Some of them need to be watered. Um, I'm going to wake him up. Do you have work today? Eight hours. Okay, that's that should be enough time. Um, I'm gonna have you go to the bathroom. Um, take a thoughtful shower for me. Um, and then I'm gonna have him get started on the garden again. Are these both diggables? <gasps> they totally are. I don't think you can get the new uh, snow globes from there. But that's okay. Um, gosh, everything needs tending right now. If I just do ten garden, will he do everything? We're gonna find out. He's also really hungry. Okay, I'm gonna have him eat after he showers. Come on, let's go ahead and tend garden after he eats. Alright, there we go. Still pretty early, so we should have enough time. He's having a good time in that shower. Wish she would hurry up though, come on. Rex, come on. Rex, please. Come on, let's do this. Also, the festivals would be like a great way for her to meet people, you know? Prospective... Prospective husbands. Or not husbands, but like... Oh, he could take family leave. I might have him do that. Maybe. I mean, she won't be having the baby until... Let's see. Probably, maybe like 2 a.m. on Friday, so... That's a problem. Um, but she is hungry again, so I'm gonna have her take another piece of cake. She's super pregnant. Why do you have cake in your inventory? You actually- I think you're- I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with these sims. Okay, his needs are pretty good. Um, I could have him start raising his social a little bit to talk to Cordelia. While they're sitting here chit chatting. Um Ask Baby's due date. Discuss food flavors. Nope, you're gonna go do that? Okay. Well, hopefully it'll get his social back up after. Okay, he should do everything they need him to do, except for like maybe evolving. I'm not entirely sure. But uh, I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Rex. Rex, please. Please do the thing. Yeah, he didn't evolve. He's weeding right now. Um, so now I'm gonna have him harvest all. Oh gosh, I thought she was about to like throw up. I was like, no, please don't. And it froze a little bit. Come on, game. Don't do this to me right now. I know, I have a lot of CC, and you don't like it, but you're gonna have to deal with it. Um, I'm gonna go take a shower for me. Actually, go take yourself a thoughtful shower. I know, you're super prego. Oh my gosh, look at this belly. Holy moly, she's ginormous. <laughs> How do you even walk? You should be like on bed rest. Oh my god, I feel so bad for her. See, she's so pregnant, bless her little heart. Poor woman. There are three diggy rocks over here. Man. Alright. You almost done with all this nonsense yet? Nope, now he's watering. Please tell me you're gonna be able to spray for bugs, because that's pretty gross. I'll just like freaking queue him up for the bug part. He's taking a sweet time. Like, I feel like it goes quicker if I click on everything. 
All right, how are you doing? You are hungry, so you're grabbing some cake. I know your mom hasn't cooked yet. I'm so sorry. Um, can you pee for me though? Because you really need to use the bathroom. Um, you're doing all right as well, but you are also quite hungry. Let me take a piece of that. Oh, honey, you're super hungry too. I know, I know, you're really hungry. Alright. I know eating cake for breakfast is not the most nutritional thing, but we don't really have that much else right now, and we're just gonna make do. I'm gonna have her come over here. She can't even resume those. Oh, yes, yeah, she can. Resume gumbo. I also don't think we're gonna be able to get this Day of the Dead thing done. I mean, we literally have six hours left. <laughs> Kinda sucks, but what can you do? It's just too hard to get that done if I'm like not sitting here dedicating myself to it day in and day out, and I frankly don't have the time for that, so maybe if someone makes a mod for it, like to uh, make it a longer of a challenge or like a permanent one like they did with the easter egg hunt, then I could totally do it. I feel like then that would be better. But as of right now, it's just a little bit too hard. Alright, so she's cooking with her big old belly. We do have some extra money. I'm almost tempted to get a video game console for like the kids and obviously Rex would totally play with them, but I don't know, just something else for them to do. I feel like it would be quite nice. I oh, don't know, we'll see. We'll see. We have so much new stuff that it's like, I don't know. Maybe we could take the family out to like the karaoke bar. Can kids sing karaoke? I'm not sure. I'm not entirely sure. Alright, so it looks like he's now harvesting. Yes, he's harvesting everything. We will worry about evolving when like he gets home from work. Um, yeah, because he works in three hours, so I don't think we'll have time. Uh, he does need to create some paintings. He's not having any fun, though. So I might have him, you know, hang out with Cordelia a little bit. How does this gumbo turn out? That looks amazing. I want that. I've always wanted to try the gumbo in, um, Disneyland, but I still have not had the chance to. There we go. Alright, are you eating again? I mean, well, yeah, I guess you are pretty hungry. Go on, you can totally eat. I'm not gonna stop you. How are your guys' grades? Um, you're almost out of- You're actually almost at an A. So are you. You guys just need to do your freaking homework. Um, why don't you go pee for me before you go to school? Um, your bladder's good, but you are still hungry. Um, let's have a quick meal of some cereal. Rapunzel, go go grab a quick meal of cereal before school, please. What's the matter? Well, what's the issue here, Rex? I'm very confused. Why why aren't you why didn't you water these ones? Oh no, are you sick? He doesn't have the mood that of being sick, so maybe he's not sick. I don't know. I wonder, do we still get the um festival notifications if we don't live in Semishuno? I would assume that we do. What what no, no, no. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Go over here and woohoo with your wife. I know you'll probably be late for work, but that's okay. Ooh, actually, before you go to work, let me uh, sell all these things here. Alright. Um... Selling all the things. I won't be able to access his, oops, his inventory while he's at work, so it's just easier to do it now. 
Oh my gosh, we just got 1,000 simoleons from the freaking bluebells. That's amazing. All right. Please go woohoo with your wife. That would be very kind of you, sir. Oh, honey, you need to go to school. Go to school. Yeah, you've eaten enough. Please go to school. Who, whose was this? I don't even know. <laughs> Whoever's hungry can have it. You're getting pretty hungry, so after you get done with that, can you please eat that? Oh no, you have to go to work. My bad. Um, and I don't have my pregnancy mod anymore because it's actually not being updated anymore. It hasn't been updated since like May, but it was still working up until this most this most recent patch for the um, expansion pack. It just stopped working, so I'm hoping that it'll be updated, but I don't really have any high hopes of it actually being updated. Like, I really can't see it being updated. Alright, so his phone got up, which is great. You're not sleeping. I need you to eat something real fast for me, please. Please, I know you have to go to work, but I really need you to eat for me. How are you doing, Mom? You need to pee again. So go do that. Test day. Eric has two different tests today, and one of them is going to be tough. There's a little time... Well, there's a little time to study beforehand. Should he spend all of his time studying for the harder test, or use the time to study for both tests equally? Study both. The extra study time was vital for that difficult test, and brushing up on the material for the easy test was worthwhile too. Eric earns a B plus and an A. Sweet. Performance gain small. Perfect. I need to uh, give Cordelia a bit of a makeover soon, I feel like. Mostly, like, a lot of her clothing attire. Alright, so you don't need to clean up. Just go to work for me before you're any later. But you are about an hour late there, Rexy Poo. But uh, I need you to do that. Alright. She's alright. She's feeling okay. She's very, very tired and very pregnant. Um, I'm gonna have her resume riding Cat Lord. We're not making that many simoleons, but that's okay. That is a okay. Who are you? You are Parker. What's up, dude? I think did he actually? Oh gosh, he just got get stuck on our mailbox. Cause that's pretty awkward for you. I'm not judging, but I'm kind of judging. In a nice manner, I would like to think. Ah. She is also getting pretty antsy to steal stuff again. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. You always should like take her out and go steal something. Ah. We have about three minutes left. So we might actually have to wait on that because she's getting hungry and tired on me again. But then I also want to take her out so she can like try some of the new cuisine and everything. Maybe I will take her out. Let's just uh, let's go ahead and travel. Um, I'm not sure where I want to go. Um, don't recall like which ones have what types of food, but I think I might just take her to like the spice market maybe. Ooh, I don't know. Maybe we'll just go to the fashion district. Let's go to the fashion district. Nope, we'll just go by ourselves. Um, I just want to get here, you know, trying some new food and broadening her horizons. And obviously we're going to be exploring all of City Living in my City Living LP, but it's going to be incorporated into my other ones, of course. So the, real, the one thing I really love about The Sims 4 is that every expansion is sort of integrated in with each other. Even like the stuff packs and the game packs, they're all very interwoven. Like the food that we got here, you can now serve in restaurants and stuff like that. So it, it is very threaded together and I really like that. It's not just stacked on top of each other in a very clunky way. It's very threaded and I really, really like that. All right, so she's dressed super- oh my gosh, look at this belly. Look at her. She's so huge. <laughs> this poor woman. Okay, so let's see what types of food we got here. Oh, the Asian food stand's not open. Are any of these open yet? Can you please open for business? Because I have a very pregnant lady who would like to some food. Um, Let's try it. Maybe I could tofu dog. Why not? Since this place isn't open. Which is what I really wanted her to have. 
<laughs> There's no one here. Can you open for business, please? There's an alien playing the sim- or playing the sims. Playing the violin. That's lovely. It's very charming, actually. Maybe after she gets done with her- Oh, the, the busker's here, too? Cool. Oh, there's the food cart lady! Yes! This is what pregnant ladies like. We like food carts. Not not we in the sense that I'm pregnant, because I'm definitely not, but you know. Let's see, what can we order? Ramen, dango. Uh, let's not do the puffer fish, let's do the ramen. Here, you can stop eating that. Just try all the food, Cordelia. I can't like throw it away. That's a bummer. Oh my gosh, that's my timer. No need to shout at us, lady. We just want our freaking... Would I order ramen? That's it. <laughs> Normal quality. It's not great, but what can you do? Looks like Cordelia is having a bit of trouble with those chopsticks. She should eat more chopstick food, like ramen, to develop that finger dexterity. Aww. You're so cute, Cordelia. I love you. Ooh, this guy's so hot. Do we need to introduce ourselves? You. We're gonna we're gonna say hi. We're gonna say hi. Oh, she's so cute, man. I love Cordelia. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna end it on this face just because it's so funny. <laughs> oh my gosh, actually no, that's kind of frightening. All right, there we go. That's a much cuter face. But I am going to go ahead and end this part here. I really hope you enjoyed this. We are going to continue our little uh, adventures in the city, if you will, once we return. And yes, I really hope you have a great day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!